Hi everyone, this is Shani from Life with Elegance, helping you look amazing. Today I want to talk about one of my favorite items in my wardrobe, the trench coat. I love trench coat so much because it is so classic. You can pair it with so many clothing items and wear it in a million ways. When I got my first trench coat, I learned this unwritten fashion rule from a personal stylist that if you want to look more casual and stylish, never belt your trench coat. So I learned many different ways about how to tie my trench coat. So today I want to show you guys the five most stylish ways to tie your trench coat. Now let's get started. First, pull both straps to one side. Cross both ends over each other. Pull one strap up and pull it back down. And up, pull it through the loop. Then adjust your belt to have a little nice knot. First, pull the right strap a little longer, cross both ends over each other, pull the right strap up, and make a knot. Then bring the longer strap underneath and make a small loop. Then use your left hand to pull it through. Now we have this half loop balanced look. Cross both ends over each other and pull. Then loop one strap, then hold. Loop another side, then hold. Then pull through into a bow. Make sure to adjust the bow to be vertical because the horizontal bow will look very cumbersome. First, keep the left side a little longer. Cross both ends over each other. Make sure the left strap underneath the right strap. Then pull the left strap up and to the left again. Then loop the left side and move the strap into the loop. And tighten as desired. First, keep the right side a little longer. Cross both ends over each other. Make sure the left strap underneath the right strap. Then pull up the right strap to make a knot. Then turn the right strap underneath the other strap. Lift it up and move the strap into the loop. Next, pull the strap through the loop. At last, you can adjust it to make the straps shorter or longer and tighten the knot. When I was in high school, our PE teacher taught us karate. What she really taught us is actually the spirit behind karate. As you know, the white belt and black belt are the lowest and highest levels in karate. I felt I could only be the white belt. To me, the black belt is just unreachable. Then my PE teacher told me one sentence that I will always remember in my life. She said, a black belt is actually a white belt who refused to give up. Even today in my early 30s, this sentence is still deeply in my heart. When other girls dream is to be a princess, I told myself, forget being a princess. I want to be a black belt. To me, the black belt doesn't mean anything. The meaning is in the whole journey to realize all the impossible dreams in my life. And during this journey, I never ever give up. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you next week. Bye! Swear it's been 700 degrees in here since you came